If you were to ask someone in the 90s what their favorite adventure game was, they'd probably say either Maniac Mansion or um, Monkey Island. If you were to ask someone in the 2000s, they'd say Sam and Max. If you were to ask someone from this decade, they'd probably say The Walking Dead. The unifying factor in all these games is that they were co-written by Dave Grossman. Welcome to the only game series that Dave Grossman has the sole writing credit on. Welcome to Judy Cube, and also welcome to Pajama Sam. No need to hide when it's dark outside. Uh, basically, if you don't already know, uh, my friend Charlie here and I have already done a uh, humongous game series where we played Freddy Fish 5, The Case of the Creature of Coral Co., which is a bad game. And uh, we decided, uh, and because people really wanted to see more, that we would play more humongous games, and we decided that we would play through the Pajama Sam series, um, or at least a couple of the games uh, if you guys wanted to see it. So what we're doing is we're starting off with one of the good games. The um, first, and we're starting off with the first one right yeah, here. Yeah, we're starting off with the first one, which is a good one. And um, if you guys want us to continue with just like playing through the good games and then leading up to the bad game, then we will. Or if you guys just want us to jump straight to the bad game after this, we will do that. Uh, just let us know. Um, but, you know, until then, we're going to be playing through freaking Pajama Sam 1, yo. Um, There's no need yeah. to hide when it's dark outside, pals. Absolutely. Uh, and if you don't already know, I am Judy. This is my friend Charlie. Uh, you can find him at uh, Public VA on YouTube and uh, also on Tumblr. Uh, I'll put all of his links to stuff in the description. Um, so, yeah, if you didn't catch all that what was happening at the beginning, um, I barely did either. But basically... He's got to go to bed, but it's dark. And he's, he's afraid of the dark. He's so scared he, of the dark. He needs his um, he needs his mask. He needs his portable bad guy containment unit or lunchbox. He needs his cape and he needs his flashlight. Hey, where are those kids? Um, that's that's no one I've ever seen before. Okay. I actually also had a above my closet door when I was a kid had a sign that said Char Street as a reference to this. <laughs> Yeah. Oh yeah, dude. I, this is this is my 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 life. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you know, as a kid, I actually also had a poster that when I touched it with my finger, it would animate and sometimes change into different posters. <laughs> you probably should have had a better uh, psychologist then. Um, okay. So you're right. looking for uh, the items. Check. Okay. The places. Uh, nope. 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 Right. That's click and right nope. click at the same time. Aha! I try. I accidentally paused it. Okay. So I'm looking for. What am I looking for again? Uh, you're looking for a mask. You're looking for a cape. You're looking for a lunchbox. You're looking for a flashlight. Go nuts. Okay. Woo! There. Nothing there. Okay. Let's do this. Let's get into some actual challenge here. Nothing but clothes in here. Nothing but clothes. Oh god, well, I terrifying. don't like that. I don't like that at all. Um Okay, so a mask, cape, and what else? A mask, cape, lunchbox, flashlight. Oh. There it is. Lunchbox. I can keep darkness in here after I capture it. We're going to go capture darkness. Oh yeah, so darkness is a dude. Oh, you have okay. the cape. So Oh yeah, we have the cape, so we just need the mask. Can't go get mom and dad. Oh yeah, that's no. the door. Okay. No, you didn't click the door. You can click the carpet. You can. Just on the corner there. Oh. <laughs> nice hint. Protect my secret identity. Now I just have to find my flashlight. Okay. Check out the bottom check, one. Check, oh check no, under the <laughs> Charlie. Oh okay. Um, excuse me, you were wrong. It was in the place that I wanted to check. It was in the bottom drawer. The Illuminator Mark V Jr. It's the Illuminator Mark V. Oh, remember Jr. D batteries? <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I'm glad our world doesn't oh, operate god. on those anymore. Okay, so what do I do? I just go in. Oh, just, just go in? Yeah. All right. All right. Just time. Let's just Oh, oh dang, he's ready. This Friday, is let's like Let's do this. All right. Oh, oh, here he goes. Oh shit! Darkness is oh, gonna crap. get it. Oh boy! Oh! Hello? Ooh! Anybody in here? Darkness. Hello. 
He's cute. Oh, no! There we go! Oh, my God! Also, yeah, we have the subtitles on, by the way, so people can read if we're talking. I, I, a, a common comparison to make for these is Calvin and Hobbes. It's pretty obvious why. But look at that background! Look at this! <laughs> this is gorgeous! Wow. It's actually, yeah, it does look really good. It looks like a, it looks like a, like a, like a children's book. It's cool. Okay. So there's not actually anything to do on this screen. If you, All right, if, so we'll just, we'll just keep going. Yeah. Oh. I can tell what I can interact with here. <laughs> oh, I had no idea my closet was this big on the inside. <laughs> hey, a board. It's too far to read. So I want you to <laughs> suspend your disbelief and and pretend with me that this is not a child making pretend. This is actually another dimension that was located in the closet. Oh, absolutely. I mean, I'm already I'm already there. Oh no! Oh my god, he's got to look out. What's he doing? <laughs> Sounds like a Monty Python character. Yeah, it does. <laughs> oh my god. I love it. Well, no, I guess not. I, um... Oh, come on! Hey, I need those! I love that just didn't have a subtitle. <laughs> hey, I need those! Nobody needs to read that. Well, I'll let you uh, figure it out. Well, let's uh, let's look around. Let's click on the thing. Look at that uh, abdominal strength this child has. Right? Oh my God! Like he's been lifting. He's been working out. Whoa! Uh, thanks. I feel bad about you losing your things. Yeah. How am I supposed to capture darkness without all my stuff? Well, I'm sure your things are here in the land of darkness somewhere. If you I like her voice. She's very chill. Find them again. I hope so. I'll bring you back your rope later, okay? Good luck. She's the okay, cool so like, one. Already right off the bat, you can just tell there's such a difference in quality and like the way they go about. I'm gonna try uh -huh. this, hold on. Also grab that sock. Oh, okay. Okay, Freddy Fish Fire. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> um. No, but yeah, like you can already just tell there's like such a difference in the way they handle things. It's not as linear. Yeah. It's not as linear and also they're not just like saying, hey, I left a thing somewhere, go get that thing. It's like, you gotta present you with a challenge. Oh, cool, a sock. So that's just a okay. little extra collect-a-thon. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, they awesome. got little extras. They got plenty of ways to keep you amused. There's mini games. Dude, dude, yeah. this is just a great fucking game. Yeah, this is Pajama Sam. This is, I've actually, I have never played a Pajama Sam game other than, um, you are eat from your head to your feet, and I only ever played the beginning of that one. Okay, so we, we want to go to Dark's house, Bort Dock, or the mines? Go to the Boat Dock. The Boat Dock! Woo! I read that as Bort Dock, didn't I? The Bort Dock. <laughs> the port dock. <laughs> well, rip. <laughs> I probably should have deduced that it probably said boat dock. Uh, by you know, considering that a port dock is not a thing. <laughs> you know, an average Tuesday. Okay, talk okay. to Otto. Oh, hey, there's another sock though. I better pick it up, like Mom said. I should match Whoa! Getting socks left Go and right. Forward. Okay. Oh, uh, forward? Could you yeah. give me a ride across the river? Oh, no. I can't go in the water. I sink. I made of wood, you know. But I don't think that's how it works. <laughs> no, I don't think so. I had this friend and he told me the story <laughs> about his dentist brother who, um, he was made of wood and he got in the water and he sank. Really? Straight to the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> 
area. I wish I'd been a car. I think your friend was wrong. Wood floats <laughs> in the water. Oh, I wish that were true. I mean, I can prove it to you, buddy. Here you go. Yep, you gotta think. See, you gotta use your... Okay, check this yeah. Out. Wood, you gotta... Right? Context yes. clues. Use your previous yeah. knowledge. Put it together. What have you got? It floats. Wood floats. Wood floats. Wood floats, yeah. everybody. So you'll float too. Come on, give it a try. I guess. And you see, oh, that's oh. educational without being beat you over the head with it. So yeah, it's just like straight up. It's like, hey, wood floats. Oh, there you go. Nothing. Oh, whoa! I'm he did it. I'm so I'm proud of him. Yeah. I know. I'm proud of Otto, too. We're all proud of him. Wow. At that moment, wow. we were all proud of Otto. <laughs> At that moment, Otto was the real star. Okay, so let's, yeah, let's hop in. Let's do this. Adventure's continuing. I'm enjoying this. <laughs> it's such a good game. Well, technically, we can't do that since I'm not a sailboat because I don't have a sail. <laughs> I know what you mean. <laughs> okay, Otto. I'm going to need you to Let's go forward, <laughs> lighten up, buddy. Sure, sure. Whatever you say. Let's go sailing. If you want to... If you, so, if you go to the right, there's like the... Oh, and then the wood sank. <laughs> if you go to the right, there's just a joke. It's not actually a part you have to do to complete the game. Which Foreboding is telling you to go there. All right. It's, Click the geyser, the the, okay. the no the the big one. Big one? Oh, it's steaming the steaming one. Oh oh okay. What is that thing anyway? That's a geyser. A what? A geyser. It's kind of a hot spring that spurts up water and steam every so often. It works kind of like a coffee percolator. Water in passages deep down where the rocks are. Gratuitous <laughs> educational <laughs> content. <laughs> <laughs> the really subtitles don't even fit yeah. on the fucking screen. Yeah. <laughs> oh my watch, god, that's watch really Sam's funny. Watch Sam's expression. Watch Sam's expression. turns into steam and pow! It erupts out, along with all the colder water on top. Then more water flows down the and the whole thing starts all over again. Oh my god, this is great! meaning gush. Geysers are usually famous exception is a geyser called Old And he's still going! Oh my god, it's like the, like the farther he goes, the funnier it gets. It looks like this one goes off a lot. Um, thanks a lot, Otto. <laughs> 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 oh my god, that's so good! Oh my god. That is- Is that our episode? Mm. I think so, I think that's a good, <laughs> a good place to end this off. So, yeah, you can already kind of see the, uh, the difference in quality here is staggering. Oh uh, my god, so, it's- yeah. look, it's the guy who wrote literally all the best adventure games. It's an Emmy Award winning actress writer. It's- you don't get better than this. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm having a chill, fun time right now. And we're going to keep having a chill, fun time next time on Judy Q. And remember to leave a comment whether you want us to play all four games or just skip to the bad one because just you hate me. Just skip to the bad ones. Yep. If you, which, whichever one you want, we'll do. If you guys want to enjoy some, some good writing and stuff, and you want to have a, a chill time hanging out with us playing these games, then let us know. But if you guys would just rather see us suffer right off the bat, let us know. Either way, we're going to play this game first, so tune in next time.